Hello, this is Mark, Recovery Freedom. In this short video, I just want to talk about what is it that makes a self-help or personal development program successful. Most programs, if not all, can bring about change in a person doing the program. This depends also about the relevancy of the program and also the complexity involved in the program itself. But the main factor involved in success of any program is the person doing the program. So the person that's participating and going through the program is yourself. So the, what really determines the success or failure of a program is you. As I said, any program can be successful bring about change, but it all depends upon the person doing the program. So if you do the work in each program as outlined, and you stick to the principles, the program can have a success rate that's pretty high. But like I said, it all depends upon the relevancy of the program, like how it relates to you and how the message is conveyed to you, and also how easy it is to follow. But the program is easy to follow and the and a, and a message is relevant to you to bring about change, then the success really depends upon the effort that you put into it. So in going to any type of self-help program, motivational or personal development program, you the person being a program or doing the program is the one responsible for the levels, level of success involved in doing a program. If you don't do the work in a program, it won't be successful. If you don't stick to the work in a program, it won't be successful. Which brings me to recovery freedom, how to start drinking. Recovery freedom, how to start drinking is based upon 13 principles that is laid out in a certain way that for every week, you'll be focusing on each principle. I discussed this in, a, in an earlier video about what makes recovery freedom different. But bringing back the success rate of a program is you doing a program. And the goal about recovery freedom is to make it as easy as possible to implement and to use. So with recovery freedom, you're given 13 principles to work with and you focus on each principle, one principle a week for 13 weeks. And the onus is upon you to focus on those principles each week and to, and to do the work according to each principle. And the way it works is that every day you'd be going through the program each week and you'd focus on a particular focal point for the week. That's pretty much it. You focus on a focus point for that week. And every day you just focus on this particular focal point. You do the actions that are outlined in the program. Additionally, as indicated previously, is that recovery freedom is based upon a 13 by four process, which is developed by Benjamin Franklin and has been transformed into many different forms throughout, throughout the years. So the short form of it is basically is that there's 13 principles that you can focus on each printable each week. And in the year, there's 52 weeks. So you're going to do each printable four times to bring it to the two weeks. So in one year, you focus on 30 printables four times. And that brings about the reinforcement of the printable. But again, everything comes back to the person that's doing the program, you. Recovery Freedom makes it easy because, like I said, you're just going to focus on the actions and the principles each week as you go along the program. And then you get to do it four times in a year. Now, Recovery Freedom, like any program or any recovery program, is a lifelong process. So, so if, for as long as you participate and are in the program, you would do the same 13 principles year in and year out, four times a year. This is, this is actually a very you know, critical part, is that you don't, you know, if you want to continue in the program, it's up to you. But the more you work the program, the more it becomes a party, the more reinforced it is. And this will bring about personal change. Recovery Freedom contains life-changing elements that will help you recover from having problem drinking. And it's based upon spiritual principles as well as printables of recovery that have been around for over 50 years. They have helped millions of people change. Recovery Freedom takes that 
the religious aspect of traditional recovery and is based on spiritual concepts as well as the principles of recovery. Recovery freedom brings about the reinforcement because you're focusing on each principle each week four times in a year. So it becomes a part of you. But you have to be the one doing the work. You have to be the one every week that's going to focus on a focal point every day. If you don't do the work, the program won't be successful. The best program won't be successful if the person doing the program is not doing the work. So in order for any program, no matter what it is, to be successful in personal development, depend upon the amount that you put into it. If you really want to start drinking, and you really want a new way of life, then you would focus on the focus points each day of each week. Recovery freedom keeps it simple. We don't want to complicate recovery. And we just want to basically make it something that's easy to implement. We just focus on one principle a day each week, four times in a year. And as you go through the program, you'll see it becomes more and more part of you and becomes or almost automatic, it becomes who you are. That's a whole entire part of reinforcing of recovery freedom. So that's about it. I just wanted to go over, you know, what makes the program successful, which is actually the person participating in doing the program. So thank you very much.